Hello everyone, welcome to another little episode. This is a map update, and as you can see, you're wondering what the heck is that? Did I build like Mangle from Five Nights at Freddy's? Sure, it does look like a robot. No, it's not that. It's not. Um, no, this is the Beacon Airs map, as I said in the uh, How to Minecraft episode. Um, oh, oh, oh that's cool. It makes it look like it's not there, and then we get up. It's not in there. Oh, cool. No, I did not mod that. Um, these are the Beaconator maps. And right there we have our ice one under construction. I told you guys it's under construction. Right now. Right here we have the... Oh, trim some of this down. And shoot, I'll fix that later. And the original Beaconator's map. If we go over here, I actually do a walkthrough of the map. If I can get over, see, we just dropped down here. Sorry if that was blinding. Um, beacons mean you're defending, grass means you're attacking. Now, I did not make this mini game by myself. I did not come up with the idea. Someone else made it on the PC. I saw it on Wolfles and Preston's channel and Pete's channel, and they decided to say, hey, why not make my own? Don't ask what that is. And here we have this, and I forget what the heck was this for, though. I think someone just said, hey, can I put this in there? I'm like, yeah, whatever. And this is stuff you get. You get this. You get that. And I have to replace that because someone... What? Get food. I can remember what I put in here. You can see this is the beginning area. The knockback stick. And you get also... A iron helmet. And then, let's just continue. So the goal of the Beacon Airs game is you, they're defenders and attackers. Defenders have to defend all three beacons from the attackers in 27 minutes, but we did 20. Um, see, here's Beacon 1. This is where the defenders spawn for Beacon 1. They could just jump down and go, and launch you off. That's where they would spawn in. There's grass over there. Or, yeah, dirt. If you come across here, here's an area... Um, this is the defender's first area they can buy. They can buy a bow and only take ten. I should put that down there. Maybe hop across here. There's nothing over there except I just made a bad little island. And then once the first beacon's destroyed, you can... Attackers can make their way up here. Defenders can. They can get iron chest plate. Um, over there are enderprisms. And this is the one that everyone hates because you can easily camp and snipe people from, but let me just say this again, defenders and attackers are only allowed 10 arrows, and if you have more than 10, then we restart the game, and, or, or we will replace the first beacon, and we will restart fully, or wherever you broke that beacon, so yep, see, there it is, people usually camp right here, or right there, now, um, defenders aren't allowed in this area. I know there have been times where defenders would be right there when we've been playing. And, yeah. And a lot of people might be saying, why haven't you recorded a round of this yet? Um, uh, just because I am lazy. I am lazy. And then this is where the second beacon is. Kind of sneaky. This is where the defenders can drop in from. I need to put this somewhere else because literally you can just crouch up here and just jump down and kill people. I was doing that one round just because, I don't know. Shut up. Then you can come down here. That over there. Um, What is that? I think, that, oh, I think that's a practically an iron sword upgrade. Oh, this needs a button. Fixed. Then you come over here. This island is this island's yours. And then you get a golden apple. Run down here. I I put I added something to this map. Just because it's like, well, why not? Yeah, we also need to get like a counting system. We got the gold boots. They just have nothing on them. I think I'm breaking. They're kind of useless. It's out there. Then you get an axe, and you can, and defenders, uh, not defenders, attackers can break the beacon with only 
an axe. So it's kind of a challenge. Challenge. Mm -hmm. I don't like this here. And then if you come over here, a lot of people haven't noticed this yet, but this is the war cry. And it's a string for 2 minutes 15 seconds. And as you can see, I mean, it's kind of like the hardest parkour. You have to, like, really keep track of your jumps. And it's also on the third beacon, so if you fluff up, hey, you die. How I do it, I just literally camp it there until my team kills them, and then I just bum rush it up here, bum rush it, and then uh, I'm in here and I'm safe. And they don't know, and then I can just go boo 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 boo. Don't make fun of me for sound effects. Then this is the little area I added. Um, a lot of this I added. Um, that this little strip right here I added. Um, this area I believe I also added. Yeah, this area I added. That little area I added. I don't know why. And here you get another gold apple and chain leggings. Maybe make that iron or diamond. I don't know. Then you guess. I just realized there was a speed boost already. I need to take that out. So, yep, that's the map, really. And then the snow one I'm working on right now, I just decided to say, well, how about I just um, do the video for you guys? And then if we just plop down here, this is what it looks like. I really do like that texture, the beacon, and then the, um, that stuff. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this little video, and I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know why I pressed the pause button. So, please subscribe to the channel. We are at 23 subscribers. I'll do like a 50 sub special, maybe a Hunger Games or something, maybe 25 I'll do a special. I don't know, but if you're new to the channel, hope you hit the subscribe button. If you want me to play a game, I'll play a game. We do Madden, we're going to start Transformers, we do Minecraft, Clash of Clans is soon, Boom Beach is soon. We do a lot of things. So I hope y'all enjoyed this little video of my Beaconeers map. The snow one will probably be up around the beginning of April, I'm going to say. These maps are kind of hard to build because you have to build those stairs and stuff. So I hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see you dudes next video. Ka-chow.